it's prom season. And you know, as a lady, I'm not mad when I just have to go out and buy a glamorous new dress, shoes to match, jewelry, some accessories like a fabulous purse. This is actually getting pretty expensive now that I think about it. So let's save you some money by using our DIY skills to make some really cool, stylish accessories that won't be too trendy and leave you regretting your choices in a few years. Yes, I did wear a black boa to prom. I found three perfectly simple black purses at my local thrift store for four to five bucks each. I found this tool at the craft store. You can buy it with glitter, without. I'm going with gold. This purse was kind of coming apart, so I helped it along and separated the front flap into two parts like this. Lay out the front flap, place the tool under the front of the flap, and add a strip of glue to the inside along the side seam. Place the end of the tool onto it to adhere. Add glue to the top of the flap and fold about half of an inch of the tool around it and carefully press down, like really carefully. Once the end of your tool is secure, you can start wrapping it around the entire flap. Secure with glue, pat down, and wrap. Wrap it taut, glue it down. Crafters have no fingertips left. I wrapped more and more as I continued so that the gold would get more intense, kind of like a gradient. When complete, cut off the end and glue down. Find a vintage rhinestone or pearl earring or brooch, cut off the back and glue it on. Remove the straps if they cheapen the look and voila, you took a $4 bobo purse and customized it into a fancy retro clutch. For more purse ideas, check out Karen's cool iridescent bag makeover and this 90s inspired daisy purse on my channel, Mac. Color block your heels in neon, or just the toe of a ballet flat. Marianne makes a heart sparkle toe in this glam handmade video. It wouldn't be a problem without jewelry, and Julia makes her shine in this rhinestone statement necklace tutorial. Bring in some movement with an ombre fringe necklace from MAC. Even the most simple black dress is special with a sequined Peter Pan collar. Or, Go with a really unique statement and rock an air plant fascinator because you are a rebel girl. Don't forget to pack Karen's DIY Snapchat photo booth props because rainbow vomit for life. Have an old fake Hawaiian lei. Cut the string to free all of the flowers. Then glue the petals onto your purse. Layer some of them on top of each other and leave some as they are. Fill both sides with flowers. And voila, a springtime textured floral bag or a purse corsage hybrid man. Which of these accessories is your favorite? Be sure to let me know in a comment below if you'd change the style of any of these DIYs. Be sure to subscribe, check me out Friday for some cool DIYs inspired by my home slice, Marianne. See you later.